So radio frequency ablation is a really unique uh, form of therapy that we use for patients, particularly who are dealing with pain that is stemming from joints, whether that's the joints of the low back, the joints of the mid-back, or the joints of the neck. We can also use radio frequency ablation to treat patients' pain in their shoulders, knees, and hips. And the way that radio frequency ablation works is that very commonly we'll start with what's called a diagnostic block, where patients will have an injection of local anesthetic targeting a particular nerve that gives feeling to one of those joints, whether it's gonna be in the neck, low back, or one of the, the joints such as the hip, knee, or shoulder. If the patients get pain relief from that injection of local anesthetic to that nerve, then we've identified a target being that nerve that we can then focus in on with radiofrequency ablation to try to make that local anesthetic effect last longer. The way that the radiofrequency ablation procedure works is by again using image guidance, whether that's x-ray or ultrasound, to again guide the uh, needle down to where that nerve is. and. In addition to injecting local anesthetic, we also use electricity through that needle to create heat around that needle tip, targeting that nerve to try to make that numbness and that pain relief last for a prolonged period of time. Very commonly with radiofrequency ablation, we see anywhere between six months and nine months of pain relief, but often for patients, they can continue to experience pain relief out to a year or even longer. Patients who particularly benefit from radiofrequency ablation are patients who have a type of constant aching, nagging pain that is either across their low back or focused into their neck area, potentially spreading out close to their shoulders. Other patients who have knee or hip or shoulder arthritis, who have undergone several rounds of injections of steroids and local anesthetics into those joints, but continue to have persistent pain. These are the types of patients that particularly benefit from radiofrequency ablation.